Hey, it's working. Well, I don't know what I did, but hey, it's working. Well, I don't know what I did, but hey. I need to learn how to mute my thing when I turn it on. See, that's weird. Now it's back to the... Anyway. All right. So we're back and now it's back to doing its weird thing, but it does work. So what we're going to try to do, update four is looking like it's going to be absolutely gigantic and I know we're going to need more space. In here, while I do have a fair bit more space for uh, archer melee build, um, new daggers and all that, I don't have a heck of a lot of space for warrior and I have not much, let's see, yeah, I don't have a lot of space for mage either, so I had already started building on this down here. This is what I'm calling the Halls of Origin, uh, or Halls of origin Origination. And I think I want to do a two-tier type of deal, where this down here is just armor. And when you're up here, this is your spells, your charges, your arrows, uh, shields, weapons, all that kind of stuff, so that we can keep all the armor in one space. Also, we're not sure if it's going to change it from... When we go from 35 or 25 to 35, all this gear up here, are we just going to get new ones that are 35? So, like... Eh, let's go to this. So, like, all this stuff right here. I mean, I know it's 23, but... Are we going to get level 33 versions of all this stuff? Or is it going to be all totally new? And oh hey, you can wear this stuff, but too bad, so sad. Or are they going to give us a way to upgrade these like we do with weapons? Where, I'll show you, I'll pull a weapon out for those of you that are unaware. You get upgrades by using the coins. I can't remember the name of them. And you can upgrade and it creases in damage, creases in level, etc. so forth. Are they going to give us something like that for the old best in slot armor kind of stuff so that if people want to still use it, they can still use it and they get better stats as it levels up? I don't know. We don't know. We know there's at least three armor sets. There's at least two weapons, at least one roof, one building block, the roof and the building block, I'm actually, I have no problem with. Uh, in fact, material-wise, I think the basement's in great shape for materials. Let me check on something real quick. Yeah. Uh, because I have almost all of that empty. Almost all of that empty. I haven't even utilized over here yet. I can utilize that whole damn thing, this whole thing. I got plenty of space for materials. It's gear... And to a lesser extent, well, I don't know necessarily lesser extent, to an additional extent, this stuff. All of our props and craftables, I've already jammed so damn much into this space, I I don't think I can put any more in here. Like, beds, for example, I'm full. I it just, I, I don't have any more, oh, wrong one, I just don't have any more room. Ta chairs, I'm full. I've even come, gone into this one. I just, I don't have any more room. So, what did I put up here? Yeah, I even put stuff up here. Okay, so I guess I do have a little bit of space more for beds. So my thought, and I'll probably be doing this for a while, a bunch of hours, not only just today, but days after days, because I think I want to bump this whole damn thing out a couple blocks it's going to be a pain because i got to move all of that stuff up there and reset it. And it's a huge pain. Like setting the windows on top of that's a pain. It's, it's going to be it's going to be rough. And I think what I can do, because the hollow hall is just beneath this. And then beneath this here. I don't know if I can do it in the back, but I could certainly do it on the sides. If I double stack these, but bring it down one level... It's hard to explain how I'll do it, but I, th I think I can make it work. I can get a tremendous additional volume of space. And then for the basement, I'm plenty good. And this quote-unquote halls of origination um, 
man, that uh, it'll give me so much armor space. I can even, if I want to, because you're kind of down here and possibly less of a problem with FPS down here. And I, I figure out how I want to do two levels, though. I don't know if I want to do a solid piece at the bottom. And then I think I kind of do... Which means I need to butt these, jump these out some. I need to find out what this tile is here. So that maybe you, maybe, let's see. Maybe I make it so that instead of this, you come down through this middle piece and come down the stairs here and then go to the sides from the middle maybe instead of how it is now. I'll have to figure that out. Figure out the logistics of that. But I got plenty of space. I gutted this out a while back. Still plenty of space in here. Could still do a whole lot. I need to redo the how I did this ceiling because I don't... I never really finished all of this after I changed it because I want it to be similar. I'd love to do it like that, but boy, whoo -wee. Talk about a pain. So that's kind of kind of what we're doing. I gotta get what all these materials are and get them in my bag. So that's roughly cut. Uh, here maybe? Nope. There's roughly cut. Either I come here and just make us a, a uh, right angle. Or I actually utilize that as some kind of a room. Uncertain how I want to do that. I could always just do the right angle, n not utilize it, and then come back and do it as a room later. I can't do anything about that stuff because it's trees. That's tree roots. Oh, uh, yucca roots. Alright, let's start working on this. Wrong one, this one. Alright. Now, decision time. How do we want to do this? Do we want to swip it here? Right here, so less of this shows through. So we don't have too much of it coming through. I think that'd be all right. Gonna move this. Where do we have? Where do we don't have one? We need to just put it like right here. That works. All right, back to work. Back to work. All right. I feel like it's a little tight right there considering how big it is, but we can always change it later. I just can't change that because that is the um, shrine. So that can't be changed at all. I will definitely probably use this block instead of what I'm using so that I, because I, I don't like the. Uh, I don't like the torches. Torches in here, I'm not not too upset about. All right, so what is, let's see. What is this block type? That is desert city wall. What the shit? All right, let's go get some desert city wall. <laughs> Desert Temple, Desert City Wall. Hmm. Let's look at Desert Temple, too. I'm definitely not against fancying it up. Oh, I see. I need to fix that there, too. Well, 
Well, that didn't work. There you go. Except, yep, I had to figure that much. Alright, so that's good to go. Let's look at the difference here. So we got Temple Block, which I think is this. No, that's Refined Sandstone. Alright, so if we did Temple Block... question is, how high? Man, the cool way would do would to be build a relief, have the mannequin standing inside the relief lit with each armor on, but god, it would take so many of them. It'd be so many boxes, this would lag so bad that I, I don't even think it would be possible. Let's do... I think it needs to be one higher than that. It's the same thing. Okay, well let's try that and see what it looks like. It's different, at least. It would give us some interest. And then we'd have some down here. Okay, so for next thing is this needs to be higher. Are we thinking that? That gives us something interesting for sure. Uh, so height-wise, we still got a ton of space. I mean, this is honestly high enough to do it. It doesn't have to bisect it and be straight up. And I like how it's following the line. I think we'll keep that.
All right, that gets us under both sides. Well, that's almost up to that level. I could come to the level, come out again, and then come down sideways instead of coming out to the middle like that. We could change it up like that. However, I do think these need to be wider. Let's go start there and we'll see how that works. What the shit? Alright, let's start with that. I think that's definitely better. It's certainly narrowing the space a bit, but I think it gives us a better feel. Much, much better. I like it better. Now this needs to come in. Two blocks. Okay. We got a nice, decent sized path. Didn't quite bisect it, so we got a good space to measure. What are these again? Refined sandstone. All right, let's go get some refined sandstone. Do do do, ba do do. This one. I'm. St I already grabbed them. Apparently, I don't know what I'm doing. All right, so let's take this. Find a happy home for it. So we got one there, one there. We don't have one over here. Okay. There we go. And there we go. So now, I think because of that height, I think I like the idea of just bringing it straight down to the middle, which means <laughs> all this work that I did. Bye bye. <laughs> okay. Do I want to come down just like I did there? Step it down like a staircase would. Maybe. Alright, first off, these are in the way. Yep, take that too. Sandstone. And then it will be at the level which is going to be the other tile. Let's 
Go ahead and chunk all this out because we don't need it. And I can jump up there. This height here. Hey, why didn't you get taken too? Jerk face, get out of there. Yeah, probably going to take a few more because I... Yeah, I don't like that. All right. I can probably put something, but... Yeah, I don't like having all that sticking out like that. We'll figure something out that it doesn't look like that. All right, so we got to go back to the temple... Back to this bad boy. Yep, solid there, perfect. Need to get rid of these guys too. Alrighty then. Nice. So now both stairs come down to a nice big open space. Let me get rid of this whole thing. Have it nice and clean underneath. I like that better. All right, so you come down like this. You can come over to either side. Now, how is that height going to translate to stairs? So we want these stairs. Two more beyond that. But I need to have something for the middle, too. I might have to cut this back just a little bit if I want to do them sideways. Hmm, I'm not really sure. Hmm. 
Oh, I missed that entirely, didn't I? Alright, there's that. Yeah, alright. Might work. It gives us four. Ah, boo. No, I think that's alright. It gives us four on both sides. That's a little weird, having to step down like that. What if I started that step down up here? So it's more prominent. Get over here, get over there, we gotta step down. And we got there our bottom co uh, colonnade or whatever you want to call it. Welcome in. Let me know if you're seeing a, a static screen or if you're actually seeing something moving because I seem to be having some issues with Twitch and I don't know what it is. Alright, so we got that. And then what we'll probably end up doing... Ooh. Uh, apparently I missed the whole ass wall over here. There we go. Make sure I miss that somewhere else too. Okay, so that's better. And then... Probably do some down lighting, but I also want... want some kind of a relief here just to give it some flavor put like a statue here or something hey there give it plenty of space damn it would you do the right, there we go. Alright. So now we have a decent amount of space there that I can put something in. It also r makes it more roomy right there too. So that'll work. Let's uh, do this. And this is... City. Desert City. And we want probably this piece. I really hate that. I wish they would fix that. Where you can't place it essentially beneath you or at your level. No, no, no. That's not what I wanted. That, yeah, that's what I wanted. There you go. All right. So now we have a, a relief in here that I can place. I don't know what, something, except I realize the floor is not the right floor. Let's do temple. And there we go. So that looks good. We come down, we come to temple. Hmm. Makes me think I should do, because this is all the same, makes me think I should do the stairs in this material so that that's more uniform. Let's take a look and see what we think. I think that might be the trick there. I mean, even that looks cool. 
where it changes to the other type. I mean, that's actually kind of cool. Let's, uh... Alright, let's leave it like that. Okay, that's a little weird. Ah, shoot. And now it just doesn't even look uniform at all. Okay. Does it really stick? Yeah, it does stick out like that. That's crazy. Alright, so we got our stairs on that side. Let's do this side. There we go. Alright, so now we come down we got our upstairs. Now, that's a really good question. How do I want to do all this? I do not want to put mannequins of every single armor type. It would be so glitchy down here. That's so much armor, but I could look at it and see. Whew, man, I feel like that's going to be so much. And what pose are we doing? Just this pose? Seems like I do a bunch of weird things. It seems like it would have to just be this pose. So now the question would be... Okay. Alright, so how would we... Put our box in... Have the box... Okay, let's go grab a box. Let's, uh... Let's grab some boxes. And let's play around with this idea and see what we can come up with. Okay, so if we did... Instead of like we normally do all the way in like that... What if we went in like that? I don't know how this is going to look. And then we did this. Like that. Whoa! Okay. Apparently I can go in way further than that. I would not have expected that. Alright. That, that's totally unexpected. Okay. Let's go into like there. Jesus. That's crazy. That's, I mean, that's cool that it's, that it sits out that far, but dang. I, I'm actually really surprised it sticks out that far. So now we're just barely sticking out. Put it up there, toe to the edge. Get it centered. Eh, it's not quite toe to the edge, is it? Yeah, I know I'm standing in the way. Okay. Alright, let's go get a set of armor and see what we think. The only problem is that then that means we're dedicating one box to an entire set of armor. That seems like a lot. Like this, I mean, granted, this box only has two two sets, but that seems like a little excessive. 
one box for every set, but shit, we could have... Hell, I don't know. At least a dozen on this wall, and then you can have another dozen down here. Well, minus this... No, not another dozen. You could have, like, ten or nine. No. Which one... Which one am I opening? Okay, all right, head away. Okay. I mean, that's damn reasonable. If I if it I can do this and not have it completely tank the FPS, that is very reasonable. But it would it definitely wouldn't be the high end stuff all the way at the end. That's silly. We'd have the high end stuff like right here at this end so that you could get get easy access to it. Let's put that. Hey. It's not what I meant to do. Uh I don't know. Let's put it up here for right now. Let's get it up high in the wall so it's not bugging us. These guys probably should be something like this for now. Just until we get what we want from them. Alright, so now we got decent light in here. So we would do. How would I want it? Would I want to do it straight up in the corner? I think I could. So to do that in the corner, I need to do that. And you do that. And that's not even correct, but it might still work. So then we take this, do that. Quite frankly, we could probably just do it like that. And then take our Mr. Skeleton. That's good. I mean, that, it works. And this is what people have been asking. It's like, can't you do it like uh, Shade does it in uh, Fort Resources? I'm like, I mean, yeah, I can. If you don't mind it wrecking your uh, FPS. So, maybe because this is, like, fully underground, maybe it won't... Okay, how far back is that? Maybe it won't be as much of a problem. Alright, so if I look at it, it's... Uh, it's about at the edge of the the bra the banding. Like I can freaking see that. Yeah, it's about right there. About the edge of the banding. Well, you can tell it's daylight. I ought to see if I can get a couple uh choice places to have the sunlight beam in all the way down somewhere. Tr a trick of the eye, if you will. Find places that people aren't going to notice that I have a hole there. I'll have to see what I can come up with. Alright, I mean, I, I think I think we're going to try this. And see see what it does to uh, FPS. <laughs> a little nervous, but I think I think it might be all right. Okay, let's, uh, let's see. Boom, boom. Are we skipping one? Or are we skipping two? Did, what did I do there? Technically, that's one. Right. 
So, oh, because it'd be the corner. Right, because that one will be in the corner. Uh, no, I want to take it all. There should be an easier way to do this where we just click on it and, you know, like, take all. Yep, this and... Nope, I already got it on. And this is Desert City. So we need that, but then we need... Yeah. Yeah, that's right. Because this corner one, which I actually need to bring the other one out a little bit further because it looks too sunk in in comparison to how the others stick out. Kind of like that. Go to the banding. Oh boy, I'm gonna be uh, duping files to get a lot of these back. Be using a whole heap and lot of them. I'd figure out what we can do for lighting that's better. Nice and bright in here. Okay, so how many's gonna be? One, two. Sixteen. Sixteen different armor sets there. Sixteen armor sets there. That's thirty-two. This bottom then can have, I don't know, twelve maybe across there. Twelve there. This can be a lot. And then I could also do a center. Okay, so what we could do, if assuming we even have this many sets, so, like, one side could be mage, one side could be warrior, and the center could be, uh, or hell, the whole bottom, for that matter, could be your uh, ranger, or something to that effect. Or it could be actually physically in the center. Maybe, maybe these down side pieces, maybe those are all your extras like your incompletes your low level craftables just stuff someone might want to put on a mannequin so we can have them in case somebody wants them okay pardon me uh cosmetics you know that kind of stuff I mean, for all intents and purposes, it seems like this is going to work how we want it to. It's going to be a lot, man. Holy crap. Going to be a lot of work. Alright, let's reset this better. It's kind of like... Kind of like that where the banding is. Same thing. Are your toes sticking off? Eh, kind of a little bit. All right, let's go. Uh, let's go grab a bunch more chests. To be fair, I don't have to use the huge chest. I could use this bad boy. One, two, three, four, five. Yeah, I could use this. If we're doing them all exactly the same. 
meaning one box has all the same pieces in it, the large chest actually works better because I could have eight full sets. Of course, I got to dupe a crap load of these if I'm going to do that. It's a lot of duping, man. <clears throat> yeah, that's a lot of work. But honestly, I don't think we're going to get more than five pieces. Makes sense. Yep, yeah, let's just do it. I can dupe them later. Fill them back up. Because the large makes more sense. Now, I don't have enough to do it all, of course, but the large does make more sense. Oh, and it's different, so I gotta figure out where. Okay, so it's gonna be to the different wood type. That's how we're gonna do it. Where the banding changes on the wood. That's fine. It, it works fine. Sticks out a reasonable amount. Okay. And it lets you see the whole hinge, so that's kind of cool anyway. already? Yeah, it's all of them already. Okay. Let's get our dudes out. Uh, let's get that first. Son of a bitch. Okay, fine. Let's try it this way. Man, Keen really need really needs to fix this. I just saw it. Come on. They've really, really gotta fix that. It is a huge pain in the ass. Right now, we'll just do it like this. Alright, back to work. Okay. Thwart it again. Mannequin, come get some. All right. Oh, you know what I should do? Once I get this all done, I'll start with the lowest level and come this direction. I think the level 23s currently will stop somewhere around here and that'll leave us room for the level 35s or 33s or whatever whatever level they give us for the new high-end stuff. 
so we have enough space. So I'm not having to do too much shuffling, but we'll leave it like that for now. Man, it's going to be a lot of mannequins. <laughs> oh, man. Okay. Let's go ahead and start working on our chunking. Technically, it's that. And that. So then... And there you go. So now that side's ready. So downstairs, how do I want to do First off, I don't want any right where the stairs are or right off of the stairs. I think there would be the first one I'd want to do. Yeah, that's a weird block for it, man. Alright, so. Is it nine? It's nine. So down here, I think, will be. Like I said, it's probably going to be like your others. Stuff that isn't necessarily um, set pieces. Okay, so where's the line? this right here. Perfect. All lines up. All right. So now we have 32, 44, or no wait, plus 18. 50. 50 armor sets plus I still have this center that I could just stack boxes back to back and have gear on both sides. Or I could do a single single line down the middle as like a wall. Actually, let's see how we are space-wise. So, let's see what the number is here. Okay, so it's 16, so it's, if I did anything down the center, it has to be a 2. I suppose the 2 could be on top of boxes. Here, let me show you what I mean. Okay, so you come down. No. Come down. You go around. So essentially, where these are right here, here would be the boxes. The boxes would stick out one more on both sides because it's, you know, two. So it'd be four wide. And then in the center on top of that, I could put, a, for all intents and purposes, a runner. Uh, do I want to use this? Oh, you know what? What if I did... Let's see... What if I did highly polished or fancy? Let's look at both of these. Highly polished and fancy. Now this would be a uh, a, a, a banister, a top. Okay, so it's not going to be fancy. Fancy's cool, but not in this situation. Highly polished. You idiot. Okay, so 
Drop this, drop this. And I could actually go all the way here because I don't... Well, it'd be nice to be able to get around. Well, but you could always come up the ladder. The stairs, I mean. Alright, so the purpose for this, then, is what you would do. It was you would have this on both sides. So it would come in half. They would back up to each other. And then you would have this... Let's see, how far would it stick over? As like a like a capstone. So we started here. Let's 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 go into the same same amount, and then go into this side. Not using the the right block here or the right chest here, but you get the idea. You come on this side, and you would come in same same spot like that, and then so this here acts as like um. Like a, like a cat, because we could then do this. On both sides. Although, I'm not liking the fancy. I, I love fancy stone. But I'm not liking it in here. It seems too much out of place. Although I like what it's doing, and then we'd have block another block, 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 block all the way down, just like we did with these guys. I just I don't like it as fancy stone. Huh. Okay. So let's try a different stone, see what we like better. Um That's temple up there, but then that's sandstone. That's temple coming down. This is sandstone. I feel like it... Well... That's a little pretentious. That's a little much, I think. Let's do Desert City Wall. And that's boring as shit. On the side it looks great. On the top it is so boring. Uh, okay. Refined sandstone. Let's try that. I don't love the sides at all. I love the top, and I don't love... Man, that's a... This is a conundrum here. I don't know exactly how I want to do this. Uh, ta -da, ta -da, we did all those. I mean, it's not going to be roughly cut. That'd be stupid. We would tie it in with that, though. Because that's roughly cut. Uh, okay. Let's pull these back. Let's get to that. Let's go uh, grab some different types and see if I can find something I like. All right. Nope. Oh, wrong side. Nope. Okay. So, yeah, I don't. I don't see well block looking good in there. Roughly cut. I don't need you at the moment. So no. What am I? I'm stupid. Yes. Let's put a rooftop. Okay. So what do we got? Limestone. Let's try it. It's worth a shot. Uh, no, no. Regular sandstone. We could try that. Mixed sandstone. That's the uh, new brick. The new brick type. We give that a try. What else do we got? I already tried to. I tried both of those. I don't see half timber. Oh no, there's the new brick type. So, oh, I have to remember what the new sandstone is then. Yeah, I don't see the brick one working very well. Uh, I don't think wood. 
I don't think wood is going to work there. Yeah. No, not plated. No, no, no. Uh... Red marble is going to stand out so badly from what it is. All right, let's try a couple different coolas. Let's see, two, two. Limestone. Oh, hell no. Regular sandstone. What you got? What you got for me? Nope. Not going to happen. This is a fancy place, people. Hmm. You know, it kind of has a similar look to the way the, the uh, temple block fits together, but it is different. Get my way. I think we found our winner. I can definitely dig that. We'll stop it there. Should we just go ahead and go all the way down and then just chunk out the section? I think we should. Just chunk it out just like we do with all of them. Very good. Alright. Yeah, so minus those aren't the right... Uh... Is his booty sticking? His legs are sticking in, aren't they? Okay, so this has a pretty big over-reveal. I might have to bring those boxes out a little bit. But yeah, I like how it's it's a nice low level. It will give us one little layer over the box, the container, which will, which will look nice, I think. And so that will give us how many? So, come down here, come there. I kind of like the idea of it going across there. So... So it should be the same. No, it should be one less. Four, five, six, seven. To do eight, I would need two more blocks. And I would shift this over one. Let's try that, see what I think. Back this off one. Well, actually. Because I'm going to shift this whole thing over one more. Alright, so. Instead of here, I want it here. Eight. All right, we now have 58, no, 16 more, 66 different, or we will have I got a lot of box duping to do. We will have 66 different armor stands, all unique. Each one of these will have... Uh, nope, nope. Oh, that might be a pain. I might, I might have to raise that up one block, because that's kind of a pain, but... Each one will have eight uh, uh, full sets of each armor. 
Yeah. I dig it. I like it. Okay. Cool. So we got that sorted. At least we got it figured out what we're going to do. I'm not going to use these. Oh, that could be interesting. Bring it all the way so that you can just come like this and run. I mean, you could do it by jumping anyway. I'll leave it like that for now. Getting uh, some weird dips and I don't know. I don't know what's going on there. All right, so we've got this figured out. This has mountains of space. I'm not really worried here, but we can go ahead and start prepping. You're full to there. I'm going to leave you like that. Let's go get six more of those. There we go. We got tons. So materials probably isn't going to be an issue. Blocks might be, but I can still come this way three. I can still come this way three full boxes. And I think... No, yeah, I can still come this way three full boxes. So I can still fit a fair number of blocks. And that, almost all of this is f empty. Almost all of that's empty. I got tons. I'm, I'm good on materials. I'll have to dupe a bunch of these boxes. But that's okay. Uh, ceiling. So I kind of like the idea of keeping it all the same. At least to here. And then maybe the, maybe the hallway is different. I also got to figure out how I want to do lighting in here because I don't I don't think just torches makes any, makes sense. So what did they do up here? Okay, so he did. Is it all that? It is. I don't feel like those are going to be bright enough, but if I put enough of them, I wonder how badly that'll mess with the uh, FPS. So he's using those. That's the sitting. Here's the hanging. Let's take 20 of them to start with and see what that looks ends up being like. start here I don't th I don't think every single spot it seems like that's just way too much but every other maybe god damn you Thanks for the sub. Uh, Slayer. Oh, Slayer, what's up, man? 
Uh, oh, now I see it. Hey, um, do me a favor. Can you tell me, are you able to see what I'm doing or you just see a picture? Because my Twitch on, on my website is not working, but my OBS says everything's fine. I just need to make sure that I haven't been streaming for an hour with just a picture. Okay, good. So I'm obviously I'm preparing for update four and I'm doing the thing everybody's been asking me to do I'm really concerned about FPS drop and I'm making a, so this is if you, I don't know how long you've been in the chat uh, this is underneath the armory I'm gonna change this for update four up here is just gonna be spells charges ammo weapons shields that kind of stuff then down here is gonna be your uh, Hulls of Origination, I don't know, it's something smarter name than that. And it's going to be all the armor, and each is going to be their own set. So we're going to have large containers, because they have the five. Eight across, so we'll have eight sets plus the mannequin of every single armor piece. This will hold 66 um, total. So, yeah, <laughs> right, it's the armory. Then upstairs is the, the Shooty McHurdy room. I gotta get this damn light off the wall, and it's being an asshole. Keen really needs to fix the, uh... No. Pick it up. They really need to fix the collision when picking stuff up. What I'd like to see them do is make it so that when you get close to something, when it, like, right there, it says pick up, it should highlight the box. Right? Highlight the thing, the the object that you're going to pick up so that I'm not picking the wrong thing up because, man, I don't know how how much really detailed building you do, but sometimes... You son of a bitch. There. Oh, I had it. I had it. Yes. So, because we don't know yet for the update... Okay. Here, let me look. Here. Oh, wait, let me grab this while I while I've got it. Okay, <laughs> just just so that I can get it out of my uh, off my damn wall. I want to try. This. I need to make sure these are all the same, so I'm not messing stuff up real quick. I think every other might be all right. So the idea behind this is, since we don't know if, for example, right now this is one of your best in slot, and this is level 23 stuff. Are they going to give us, for example, if I take a weapon out of here, and you know by now when you, when you go into your, hey, when you go into your weapon, you can upgrade it using the coins. Are they going to give us that option for the current armor? Let's say I don't know for whatever reason you want to still use the Radiant Paladin, right? But it's level 25. You're not going to use level 25 at level 35, surely, with the new gear. Are they going to give us a way to upgrade armor at some point? Or is this level 25 gear just going to go into the halls of... Uh, I'll put it on a mannequin somewhere and showcase what used to be. Which might happen. And so since I don't know that, I'm making lots of room for armor. The stuff upstairs is already... Uh, the melee stuff is almost completely full. The ranger stuff, I've got a couple boxes open. And mage, I've got one box open. So there is still some space it's just it's not enough and now that I did these I'm thinking what if I did the hanging ones of course went all the way over here maybe get the hanging ones I mean I've got tons of space in here because th this is something I've been working offline for a while as I connected the two spaces the basement to the armory and this has tons I'm I have no concern whatsoever for all the extra shit they throw at us here but I am concerned about the arm. Wrong way. I'm also really concerned about the square. I have this thing so maxed out. I don't know what I'm going to do if they give us more craftables. <laughs> Hope there'll be an NPC for it because you can remember the only blacksmith can upgrade the gear. We need. Well. We need armor to upgrade armor. Oh, that's an idea. A new NPC called an ar the Armorer or something or or um yeah I, armor that's that yeah yeah that would be cool all right 
so I also want to try the hanging ones because I feel like the other ones are just uh, they're not fancy enough. So I have an idea for all this too. Let me show, give you an idea. So my hollow hall is completely contained under this, except for right here. It goes back underneath all of this, and it's it's pretty shallow. There's only like one or two blocks depth. On these sides, what I think I can do, if you can imagine. I bump this out, say, two blocks. Build it the same. Do the same thing that... Um, damn, can't remember the name of the dude that started this out. Anyway, build it out the same, but lower it down one level. Uh, you want to ask me, do you have the light burst scroll? No, I still have not found a scroll. I, to be fair, I haven't really been looking around in the low-level areas to see if I could find a light burst scroll. It's it's just the the eternal. But I think if I drop that down one level, I could stack the boxes, still have that stuff there, and get tons of more space for stuff. Cause like, like right here, I already got five of them for doors and windows, just because they're just so damn many of them, and I feel like. I don't think I'm going to be able to cram any more boxes back here. So I think that's that's going to be the biggest challenge. I'm probably going to stream in the evening for the next several days doing this while I'm working on this. Uh, trying to get it into some level of I feel comfortable when it comes out that it's not going to just drown us in stuff. Okay, so let's try... Now, how low does it hang? It does not hold, hang laying low at all. But let's try it anyway. Let's go right to there. I feel like that's not bad. Every other. Right to there. So not this one, but this one. I'm trying to... And, and this is... It could. Well, it's not going to snap exactly where I want it. But I suppose it wouldn't have to. It, I don't know. I, I've gotten so used to precise uh, placement of items, I kind of just tend to forget snapping exists often. It's, uh, I don't know. It's, it's a habit, I guess, is the best way to say it. Uh, I th okay, so we, I want to take this out and see what it's like without this. Maybe. <laughs> you jerk. Come on, it's just right there. Okay, screw you. Get off my wall. Now I'll pick you. I, I think it'll be alright. See, because what I, whenever I try to do anything with the public resource world, I'm trying to keep things the same. So I didn't build the world; someone else did. The only thing that I built in here is the hollow halls. I mean, I've renovated it several times, but I didn't build any of this. So I try to keep everything the same. Hope they'll add a bigger blueprint to build or something like root bigger areas. Oh my God! Yes, Jesus, having to do. Having to do either this, chunk it, erase it, chunk it, erase it, is, and this is the biggest that we can get, unless you want to just use that, which is ridiculously small in comparison, because, my god, that hollow hall is, it's part of the reason that I've never finished it, is digging is a pain. I, I have serious respect for those people that dig all the way to the mantle. You know, I, I give up after a while because I'm like, yeah, I'm 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 done with this. I'm I'm over it. <laughs> it just becomes too much. Let's put one of these at each end, and then put those down the middle. I like that. I think that'll work. All right, now let's see if I can get this. Hey, look at you. Do you want to see my build? I can log in for short. Uh, 
I would say not while I'm streaming this, but we could do it a different time. Because while you're here, there may be others that are here to uh, to watch the stream. Or to watch this build, I should say. I think that'll work. I think that'll be bright enough. Well, if you if this is kind of like nor your normal like time frame, then we can come together at some point and and go over it. I should build a chandelier or two chandeliers. I gotta be careful though. The more crap I build, the the worse the uh, FPS is gonna get. So I gotta be real okay. It's kind of a balancing act with this thing. It, those boxes take up so much of our. Um, Let's see, yep, I'd put it like that. It's nine for you now. Okay, so you're ten hours. Okay, ten hours difference. It is just came up on 11 for me. All right, so it's on this one. Yeah, right? Yes. Let's make sure. Yep. Okay. All right, another set. Another reason I'm doing this is I finished my Halloween build. That's what I streamed the last four days. Hey, I've got that turned off, so go spam somebody else. Oh, man. Maybe that's not going to be bright enough. I'll have to get it all in here and find out. I may have to change to something else. I don't know if that's going to be bright enough now that I look at it because I took all the rest of the lights off. It would make sense to have the torches here because well, but I don't you don't normally have torches in there. I could do a little bit of the same where I do some of the light block. Maybe make some kind of a cool uh, mosaic in the ceiling or something. I gotta make sure it doesn't bleed through. I don't really want to put... I don't want to merge Hollow Hall into that. I think that'd be a little weird. Should I do it along the sides? Or should I... Maybe try for some kind of like... Uh, not that. Try for some kind of... Damn it. Stop moving. Um, I'll, ha I'll have some kind of a drop down around that so it's not just that but something maybe along these lines Okay, so as far as the gear, the way it's going to be, since this upper deck is kind of like the more premium space, you, I know people are going to be pissed at me, Mage, war, Warrior, um, and then down here, probably this whole center section, because it's a triad, is going to be your Ranger. Then these over here on both sides are going to be all the like weird stuff. So the three pieces, the whatever, and I'm going to go in order of the highest level gear all the way down to the lowest level gear, the furthest away. Right now, that is the highest level, but obviously it won't be. I'll have to have that like say over here or something. So as soon as you come down the stairs or go up the stairs, boom, high level gear all the way down to low level. And then same thing here, the highest level uh, 
gear for the uh, ranger first, and it'll go down to the lowest level. So that's the idea. That's it's kind of how I have it up here in the box. At top left, I have the highest, and then it goes down, goes down, goes down until it gets to the bottom. So that way, it's reasonable. But it's you're, you're going to see it because now I'm going to actually display it. People have been asking me to do that for a while, and so I'm like, all right, we'll do that. I right, I just hope it doesn't. I mean, I'm I'm still holding at uh, capped 60 FPS, so probably will be fine. Okay, so what kind of box around that should I do? Let's see. Temple? Damn it. I mean, that's kind of neat. Let's go see that it doesn't bleed into the top. It's still daytime, so we wouldn't be able to tell anyway. Will this be hosted on server? Are you going to add to the file? So, uh, both. Uh, well, okay. L let me back that up. Uh... The files are always made available on the Discord, and I have them on my Patreon. Uh, no paywall. It's always just a free member on Patreon. And I host them there. It's f just in case something happens to the Discord, just in case Keen ever changes their mind on it and says, okay, we don't care if you do it, but stop posting it in Discord. I don't know. Well, it doesn't matter. Keen has come forward and said they don't care about public resource worlds. They're like, hey, man, you do you. Cub was the one that showed us how to do this in the first place. Cool username bro, uh, the one of the uh, community managers. It's it's a backup. That's literally what it is. It is a backup. And so back during the demo, the Steam um, Steam save cloud saves were killing the game. Like you would lose because we had an eight hour limit. People would work for like six hours. Man, look at this cool thing. And then oh, Steam just nuked everything. You're like, ah, you're losing your mind, right? So, Cub was the one that showed us how to actually do all this stuff. How to, how to you know, show your share your world with everybody else. And they came into Discord some while back. Uh, Shade thought that uh, Fort Resources got nuked, but it turned out it was something else that happened. And they said, no, we're fine with it. I mean, they're not fine with exploiting or, um, like, hacking the game or anything like that. They've even said they're fine with the builder's uh, companion. So, but, just in case, I always have that on my Patreon, and it's always free. You just need a, a free Patreon membership. Uh, it'll be there, but the... Hmm, let me see if I can find the dude's name. Discord. There is a guy that hosts it. Um, doo -doo -doo. Let me see. It's probably going to be up a ways. I don't think he's said anything in chat for a while. Yoda Dakota, I think. Pretty sure it's Yoda Dakota, and he hosts it for free. So while Public Resource World uh, V3.5 isn't up as frequently, uh, I would say, as like uh, Fort Resources or Wolfix, it, it is up fairly regularly. Now, Builder's Companion, you have all the items game, if I'm not mistaken, with props, it's useless. It is. I wish, and this is going to be a bit of a tell on me, I wish I was smart enough to get it working right, because... Some of the things those guys are able to do, guys, girls, the the folks are able to do that use it is incredible, and I w I would love to be able to do some of that stuff. Um, but I I just I don't know I 
my my dumb brain just isn't figuring it out for some reason and such is life so I'll, I'll, I'll probably keep playing with it at some point see if I can get it to work let's see I did one more okay Switch back to Temple. And I did see uh, Cub, once again. He was in Steam forums yesterday, uh, replying to somebody else. It wasn't something I did. Uh, replied to somebody else that... Uh, Creative mode is still on their radar. No guarantee, but it is something that they still want to do. Sorry, I need to jerk. There we go. I need to change back to my Twitch so I can make sure I'm seeing what's happening. Um, will creative mode happen? What will creative mode be? I don't know. I don't even know if Keen knows for sure. I would love to see a creative mode, but I mean, we'll see what happens. You know, I'm definitely not against those those light flowers, the light whatever you want to call those. I can definitely dig that. I don't know if I want to do more yet, but I, I like it for there. Alright. I think this room is prepared as I can prepare it, short of uh, duping a whole lot of boxes, which I'll do offline. I'm not going to do that. Make you guys sit here and wait for me to keep coming back online. we got all of our lighting, maybe... Maybe we have to do more. I need to come figure out what I'm going to do in this space here. Maybe this one could be a mannequin that has the... One of the... Um, cosmetics. That could be cool. This could be, a, this could be a cosmetic... Oh, it could be the cosmetic box that has the cos... Dude, that's, that's what I'm going to do right there. And this one I'm going to go ahead and use a big box because as they expand the cosmetics, I can add more shit in here. Alright, so come into that right there. Alright, which cosmetic are we going to do? I think we're going to do the hollow hall. I mean, it's Twitch drop, but I think that makes sense to do. All right. Mannequin. Need to figure out a decent way to light this in here. All right. Uh, I must have that equipped. Or something. What the hell? I don't know. Or that's new. That's what I just put in my bag, maybe. Yeah, it must have grabbed some of them from a different spot. All right, let me put these back. I'll have to figure out some way to light that and get it looking better. How many cosmetic gear sets you're looking at right there? That's it so far. So these three, uh, let's see. These two came out with um, the Meyer, I believe. Yeah, five sounds right. Or four, four or five. Well, there's two different colors of this, so there's two colors for the hollow. Yeah, five sounds right. Someone was saying, maybe it was you that said it. Uh, someone was saying in Discord that there might be some welcome in somebody uh, might be in uh, cosmetics for the new update as well. I only saw armor sets, but. It's hard to say, just because 
uh, an NPC was wearing something doesn't mean that it was armor or it doesn't mean that it was cosmetics. It's hard to say what uh, actually the item is they were wearing. All right, now I need to see about this. Okay, I'd get some of those and see where they sit on the ceiling, see if I can do replicate it further. Okay, there was three. I, I couldn't remember if there was three from the mire or not. I swear there was... Okay, hang on. I swear there was one a while back... Like, that we already had one when the Meyer came out. But it was like, like the princess one or something. I... Yeah, I'm, I'm have My brain's not working. I'm having a hard time thinking where... Where another one was from. But I want to... I want to say... We had one set... Then the Twitch set is just two different colors of the same thing. Oh, wait, no, no, no. The Twitch drop is just the purple. Oh, yeah, so that's right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, so... The red... And... and one of these... I, I One of these we already had. One of these we got. That we got in Meyer. The purple is the twitch drops, and the red is the the uh, third piece from the mire. I don't remember which. I want to say this is what we had originally. This dress one. The noble set. And I think royal is what we got with mire. Damn, that's hard to remember. It'd be cool if there was a little tag on the item that said what it was. Oh, I'm going the wrong way. Ah, I can go there this way. I need to check see what I can do with this ceiling here. Alright, so how do these sit up there? So the same level that it is now is what I would do it if I wanted to have them the same. Okay. But I do need a little bit more of the castle block. Is it this one? This one? There. Nope, that's city wall. Put it back. Uh... There it is. Alright, so if I want to finish my beams, because I kind of like the idea of it. Let's get my thing back here. Alright. This one we need... That's a gripe that I have. When you haven't been using something for a little bit, it still keeps it on your list until you log out. Sometimes, even if you don't have anything in your bag. It's kind of annoying. Alright, so here we go. Let's see. Yeah, it's going to be a problem. I don't know if I can do this here. Let's try. Yep, it's not going to let me. Because that is actually the space. So that continues the beam... And it's in a weird spot, unless I just put a column here to terminate it. I could do that, like this. Need to move this to somewhere that's not right there. Uh, let's do this side. There we go. Uh, you were fine. I, 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 I'm I having a hard time remembering as well. Wait a minute. Uh, well, now that I have more script, put some more up. I want more light. Until I get all this done. There we go. Alright, let's get this column f 
fleshed out. What am I doing this for? Do it like this. Do it the smart way. There we go. Alright, so now we get a column for that corner, which won't quite match that because this sticks out further by two blocks. Of course it does. So what I'll have to do, that's not a problem. Just do that. Ah, damn it. Messed that up. There we go. And then I can bring this over and it will be a little a little bit off, but it won't look too bad. <laughs> Except for where the uh, shrine is and I can't do anything about the shrine being there. Oh well, such is life. All right, so we got our column beams there, and I realize there's literally no point of the structural supports, but I like it. I think it looks nice. So there are four according to Wiki Web's Explorer, Noble, and Exclusive. Well, technically the hollows. I mean, okay, it is just one piece. It's just two colors. So five if you count it that way. I also would not trust the wiki. I don't know why, as popular as this game is, that more people aren't adding to the wiki. Damn it, I keep missing. Adding to the wiki. It's got a lot of outdated stuff on it. Uh, nope, that's going to crack that open if I do that. There we go. And there we go. It does. Yeah. As long as you have some idea of what it is, then it still helps. I think we'll be okay once we put up these. It'll kind of hide this little jun junction right there that's a little weird looking. Alright, so now the fun part. Chunking out all of this one by one until I get enough space I can use the double. Nope, nope, back. I gotta be real careful where I'm at right here because there is a yucca plant right above us. You can see the roots right there. Uh, what visual bug? What are we talking about? Sorry? I think I'm lost now. Are you talking about this? If you're talking about this, that's the the altar, the flame altar. Yeah, it's just the flame altar. I you can't like build in in its hitbox, so that's why it looks that way. But when I do when I bring this over all the way and I stick up the metal grates it'll hide the corner of it. So it'll probably make that dis make that little weirdness disappear. I say probably. I don't know for sure. But it probably will. Alright. Should be enough I can get to this now. No, damn it. I'd be real careful because I'm like one block from the surface here. Oh, I'm not over far enough. So, none of... So, this was the original wall right here. I built all of that, or dug it all out. On top of that, this floor was only this deep. I, when, uh, so this was for... What's the last one we just had? Back to the Shroud? Back to the Shroud. I dug this down four blocks or three blocks so that I could double stack these high and still have a display up there of what the items were. At least reasonably so. I can't, you know, I can't put like iron bars up there. I wish I could. That'd be, man, now that's something I want. If they'll let us stack like iron bars and 
all the various things that they're out in the world. There's already a model for it because you can go and pick up iron bars and copper bars and chunks of copper and stuff like that. I, I realize the builder's companion allows you to do that stuff. But if the if the devs will allow us to do it, that'd be sweet. And it'll probably have to wait until we get a, uh, a creative mode. Steel. Let me think for a minute. It might make sense for uh, in the picture that I showed on the PR, PRW's uh, thread. It's the most recent tease that they did to us on Twitter. Uh, that might make sense for um, the the new set that they that they teased. Um, it looks very like like barbarian. I don't know that it looks steel, but I could see steel being a a concern for it, something you have to use to build with it. How did that light block get up there? I don't know, but that's damn near the surface. I think that is right there is pretty much close to the surface. Okay. So now we're gonna do like Yeah, not that boy. How about this one? <laughs> Be careful here that I don't overdo it. No no. Okay, one block, one block. Right there. Is that the right height? think so. Yep, looks right. Gonna be bright in here. So this actually needs another row. I, I'm really excited for update 4. Update 4 looks like it's gonna be absolute... You know, wait, yeah? Yeah, no, I need that piece absolutely gigantic. Uh, I mean, obviously, we're getting a new biome, so that, that alone is going to make it much, much larger than what we've... No, that was right. What we've already had access to. But yeah, I, I'm, I'm super excited. I should probably stop doing that. I still need to chunk more out. There we go. Jerk, let me attach to it. Do you think we'll have additional crafting NPCs? So, I don't know. And the reason I say I don't know is this. So, that we already know that not only will our current master crafters be capable of kind of wandering a little bit, I don't think they're really going to wander much. I think what they're going to do is walk around in a very small radius around where we place them. Uh, pacing, right? You know, like they're, they're fidget walking kind of thing. I don't think they're actually going to walk around our base and you go to where he's at and he's halfway across the base using the shitter. I don't think it's going to be like that. But we're also supposed to be getting actual NP, uh, flavor NPCs. So by flavor NPCs, probably, and, and just... You know, this is just a guess. I don't I don't have an inside scoop or anything. They said something about if you help NPCs out in the wild or something that they may be willing to come and be part of your town folk. So they specifically called them townsfolk. That m leads me to think that we're going to be able to do... We go do a quest and let's say we save... I, I don't know. We, we save uh, a prisoner at a scav camp it, that's in a cage or something. And they're like, oh man, just take me with you, please. I'll, I'll do anything. Uh, I, I know how to sew. Do you need do you need a, a tailor? That's one we don't have. Do you need a tailor? I, I know how to sew. Uh, I don't know that that... Because that would sound more like a crafter to me. But And then they will be probably, again, this is kind of... This is guesstimate here probably be 
less than or completely non-interactable in our base, in that all they do is go about being uh, an NPC in the base. A digger. You know, there is a job in the Middle Ages, uh, God, what do they call it? Where you were the person that dealt with everybody's dookie, and it, there was an actual name for it. Uh, it wasn't like, you know, poop handler or something like that. But uh, you were also responsible for um, making sure you composted everything, uh, because obviously, you know, uh, they call it, I think back then they called it night soil, your uh, your effluent because it was very valuable uh, for growing stuff. Was it called a dweller? Is that what it was? Uh, stronghold, the second one. Stronghold two uses them, I think. I believe oh, I'm still one short. Okay, back to digging. But that could be cool to to have uh, a uh, an NPC that does that job, and then because uh, we're gonna have an animal husbandry, we've already seen what mountain goats or something like that. Um, okay, so that all looks prepared. That doesn't seem like it went over far enough, but it did. Yeah, it's still doing the same thing every time. All right, let's go back to the. Uh, this jobby. Hey, hey. Come on. There we go. Uh, is that centered? One more over. Is that centered? Man, it's hard to tell. Okay, so that one's that she. The gal that did this was the one that, that won the contest for Emily's farm. She did it right there. So I'm going to do it right there. So it links up together. Well, it didn't really hide it, but at least it's not that as noticeable now. Okay, bring it all the way down. Oh, it's not going to let me go any further back because of that. Well, phooey. It's going to look a little goofy. Alright, so now we have... Ah, hers does the same thing. So now we have everything tied in together. This is just like the ceiling that she had done before. So that's all tied in. I can add more boxes here if I want to. I've got crap loads of boxes for materials. So that's set. I'll have to do a bunch of duping to get this finished out because I need a crap load of those boxes. The large, so that's all set. And it'll give me plenty of space up top to put in more weapons. New, uh, We saw a two-hander. Possibly two different two-handers. It's kind of hard to say um, based off of what we saw. Alright, I don't need a bunch of this stuff in my bags. Uh, this here. Okay. There's that. Uh, no, I need castle block because that's outside. These all go out there. But I definitely don't need like temple stuff. Okay. Oh, now I have excess. Well, let's just get rid of you. Do do do. What do we got here? This one. And this one. Get rid of that. Bigger stacks. I can agree. I, I don't mind 5,000 for the blocks. I, I think that's fine. Uh, but this is absurd. Five for life. And, and it, what's worse, <laughs> it's five for most of the lights, except for one skull candle stacks to 250 or 500 or something. It's like it's like someone forgot and added some zeros. Just one, just one candle does that, and that's the that is the the uh, base stock level. It's it's not something that uh, 
got messed up or something like that. It's that's what it stacks to, and it's like that's so weird. It's so random that it that it ended up being that way. Uh, put that there. Okay, and you. Yes, no, maybe so. All right, that gets rid of a bunch of junk out of my bags, because we're gonna go work on the square now, and that's gonna be an absolute nightmare. This would be such a pain working on the square. I have rebuilt that thing twice already now, and this is the third time, and this time I want it, like, good. Uh, real quick, I'm going to, now that we're working outside, I'm going to reset the day so that we can see better. Alright. I need boxes to work on this. Mm, probably do two of them for now. That's good enough. So I gotta move stuff. Well, the thought is bump this thing out two all the way around move a bunch of this stuff back and allows me to widen this space that e even though I shrunk the hollow halls in that is a complaint a few people have is that because this is here this isn't as open as it used to be and that's fine I don't mind moving it back it's like this too man this is all stuff from the shroud update or uh, not all from the shot update, but some of it. Man, there's just so so many boxes everywhere. I want to double stack them. I think it'll be better. Oh god, where to start? Let's start on the other side because I don't because it doesn't have that jut out thing. All right. Need to get these out of here. So it's every four. Damn it. <laughs> I don't know if you've noticed. I do primarily buildings all I do anymore. Uh, when you're in your base, uh, ever since the either the Mire or back to the Shroud, I don't remember which one did it, the bees will fly halfway across across the map just to come and get you. They never used to do that. You used to have to get close to their nest, but man, they will come come at you from a serious distance now. I'll just be chilling inside, inside my base, like literally inside, inside a house in my base, and they will come in the front door <laughs> and attack me. And I'm just like, bro, what'd I do to you? Isaac, it's kind of funny. Actually, you know what? I may not move this over here, so let's leave those as they are. Alrighty. Let's start doing the do. Uh, let's do it this way. Let's do it this way. Alright, so I want to go turn that off to out. Oh, this I gotta be very careful with over here. 
Is it this hollow hall? It, it no joke is like one or two blocks below this. So I gotta be super careful back here. This one I think I'd be all right, but the next one I don't think I can go down. I need to change to this. Be okay right here to do this. That, should, that shouldn't cause me problems. And then I go inside the hollow hall, hollow hall to do something, and it's like I got all these rando blocks sticking through the ceiling. Come on, get down. Okay, I'll go this way. No. Okay, now go back. Very good. The plan with this is to make this renovation for more than just this next update. We need like a progress progression percentage or information of the map, like how many things we've discovered, what settlements need to be explored, the only things need ticks or the obelisks and shroud roots. I mean, that's kind of reasonable. Think of it like, um, not necessarily achievement, more like a completionist task. I mean, that could be an interesting NPC, to be honest. Have a, an NPC that pops in to that you talk to to let you know how far you have come. Uh, that could actually be so. Like a think of like a like a storyteller, and they're right. They're 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 keeping track of your your life and your experiences. I don't remember if it started right away. Tree, why you gotta be in my way, bro? That could be interesting, though. One, two, three. I feel like it's harder to renovate things and keep the same, keep the 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 uh, spirit of the original than it is to just change things up and do something all new. But I I feel like I don't know if it, it, I I think that it's a better challenge to do it this way. It certainly takes longer, but I feel like I get more satisfaction from it because I'm keeping the spirit of the original builder in how it was so that anybody that's used it over the past while now, months, uh, six months or something, I mean, I think this thing was up within like the first month, then, then they, they know where things are. What is shining over there? Oh, it's a flag moving. <laughs> One, two, three.
I don't remember if there was any over here on this side. I don't think there was. Let's see how it goes and we'll maybe put some in there. I feel like there wasn't one there, and I still have three left, so there must have been some over here. That'll work. That's good enough. Okay. So, now we have the basics. And now for the awful part is i got to move all this stuff back and try to keep it in the same spirit as what it is. Oh man, the tree's gonna be a dick, isn't it? Oh no, it's the Athenor. That thing, the hitbox on this thing is stupid. It's so dumb. Alright, so... Now we have some extra space going backwards. Right, I need to put all this crap up. It's going to clog my bags. And you are in, what, this one? No. This one. Yeah, that. There it is. This one thing stacks in 500. The rest are in 5. Someone added some zeros at Keen and just no one noticed, I guess. And everybody's like, okay. Alright, so I got some extras. I don't need them. We got planties. I hope I can do what I think I can do with this and make it work. All right. I know it'd be easier if I didn't have all my all my stuff in my bag, but yeah, such is life. Oh, here, just do that. Okay. I'm looking forward to seeing the uh, flamethrower. I honestly don't think it's going to be a good weapon, but I think it's going to be a fun toy. Because I, I honestly cannot see it being that good of a practical weapon I I would even bet that it it's a cast so it slows you slows your movement as you're using it probably I mean it's usually how they do weapons like that I just but it looks cool 
it looks like it'd be a lot of fun to use. And apparently melts snow. So that could be interesting, especially since we're getting some level of uh, weather. Not sure exactly if it's like weather 1.0 and it'll be more stuff later and exactly and they'll tweak it as it goes but we're getting something to do with weather probably won't be like snowing where I'm standing right now but it'll be interesting to see what it does okay so now right the other thing I have to do is raise this. It's not just enough to move it back. I have to raise it one block. Damn it. This is going to be a challenge to say the least. Alright, now, the idea for this... Man! <laughs> the collision on these things! I think it's this one doing it. It was. Okay. <laughs> That's ridiculous. They're all just like, no! Uh, just because there's not enough space. They're all here. So it just starts at the front. And it goes machine after machine after machine. And it just... So I used to have the ecto ectoplasm press down in the hollow hall, but for this past update, I merged everything into their spaces. So you didn't have to go run into the hollow halls anymore to grab stuff, except I did move all the flowers. Someone pointed that out. So all, all the flowers and the pots are still downstairs. Alright, so the idea here, now how far back do I need to go to really do this right? I mean, would it, would it be like that? That definitely doesn't go through. And I'm going to go back to having a space between them, I think. I think that's what I can do. So there were only three of them right here, and I'm going to fit six. At least, that's the idea. I need to go down one. And the trick on it is I'm going to come out one. Whoop. Why are you not letting me? What the hell?
what it it really is this stupid grass let's just try to do the back ones so I can get this finished it is the dumbass grass okay so here is my idea let's see if it works So you'd have this back, but down one. And you'd have one on top, directly on top of it, and it's too... Okay, i got to fix that. It's too far back. How bad did I screw that up? So it's got to come out about there, okay. I would love to have a better camera in this game. I wanted to do that. So then... Da -da 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 -da. Okay, I'll reset the day. I don't want to build in the dark. back three total. Give us more space. Alright, so now... No. Let's see if I can fit that back in there and get it leveled to where it's... I should be able to. Uh, backwards. That's... Yep. That totally works. Damn it. <laughs> oh, man. Okay, let's not do backwards this time. Wow, how badly is that? That is off so bad. How did I screw it up that badly? I don't know, I got it right that time. I, th I think this could work. Okay, so let's get our... Uh, should I put boxes in there first, or... I'm going to have a problem with collision if I don't. Tree, let me up here. <laughs> oh, man. Problems. Okay, so let's put this... The collision on this isn't too bad. I feel like one block higher isn't going to be too much of a concern. People should still be able to easily see the things up here. I mean, I almost crunched it in there a little too much. Of course, I'm going to be 
merging them kind of all together so I, I'll be able to do it a little better. Yeah, I mean, I can see for the most part what's up there. I might spread them just a little bit more, but I think the uh, triple box thing just might work for us. The last time I did this renovation, I did my absolute best not to relocate things that people had were used to being in that exact spot for so long. A few things I did have no choice. I mean, I just there were a few things that, like these over here, are now all your consumables. And they, while some of these were here, they weren't all exactly like this. And... It's a little different than it was. Meat and stuff was all over there before. But I did try. I mean, it's it's one of those things where it's a it's a tall task to take over for what someone else has done and try to keep everybody happy with what it is. Alright, let's just stick you there for now. Actually, it might be pretty good. I'd love for that to get fixed too, so it doesn't sit there and tell me all the things I put in my bag, even though I've already found them before and put them in my bag before. It's like, yeah, I know. I've been there, done that, bro. I don't know how difficult that is to code, to change it so that something that's special that you they want you to pay attention to doesn't uh, ping in your in your. Uh, screen over and over again. How far in is that? Oh, it's quite a bit in. Okay. So as long as it's forward of that. Okay, the bottom one needs to come up. All right, so far so good, and I like it. It gives us a little bit more separation now between the boxes. They're not so crammed in there like I had to do this last time. Uh, let's put this on the top. I think it's going to work. I think uh, it'll give us a mountain more of space. Okay, so now the question is, how much do I want to condense this? What amount of space do I want to leave? Because that's already empty. I only have things in these two. So maybe... Have another empty there. Uh, that bloom's coming through the wall pretty good there. What's up with that? It's in Emily's house, right? Boy, she's a bloomin', ain't she? <laughs> I 
All right, let's go back. Get a couple more. was not a bad shot on that first try on that bottom one not bad at all very good nice all right so that works so I think I'll leave these two blank and I'll go to the next one for all of this stuff which means I need a box to move stuff into I can also add more of some of this stuff now that I'll have more space. I don't know why we need a bunch of construction hammers, but you never know. For completion's sake. No, no. That one. Thank you. All right. So now we can do all that stuff. Drop a couple boxes down. So it's just got the... Okay. Honestly, I feel like that could just be like... Uh, chilling right over here. Maybe kind of kind of doing that jobby. I could have sworn I had done that. I did not. There we go. Alrighty then, we gotta go the size here.
there there's been small bits, but yes, three three major updates: Hollow Halls, uh, Melodies of the Mire, Back to the Shroud. This one's going to be something uh, mountain. I don't I don't know if they're going to call it mountain, but yeah, something mountain. coming together. I like it. I like the double stack. I think it works well. Having this little jut out in the in the bottom actually makes it more visible. Oh yeah, right. I got to put everything back together, huh? Let's leave a little bit of space because you never know. I'm not stuck by one of them, I'm stuck by the other one. I feel like, let's just go ahead and do that with that guy. Yeah, now I'm stuck by all of them. Like, nah, brah, you ain't going nowhere. There we go. That's a little better looking anyway. The Mr. Scarecrow, we can kind of have you just like that, I think. Yeah. Yeah, that works. Spread out enough that you can see what the hell's going on. Very nice. I want to move this. With the building companion, you can place the saw blades on the walls the same way. So, I actually, I don't know that I was the first, but I was one of the first to figure out that you can embed them, embed the saw table. Um, I know it's not called a saw table, but you can embed it into a wall to make it look like like only a, the saw is sticking out now obviously not the blades itself and I know what you're talking about you're talking about the crafting blade which is awesome I I think it all should I I'm one of those uh, people who think we should have options um, if it's a prop that the developers developers can place then make it available for the players. I mean, they've got to know we want that stuff, so why not? I, I'm sure the argument is, well, but when we place it, it's not complete. You know, there's it's missing a bottom or uh, the collision's not right because they, you know, it's they're maybe on crunch time trying to get certain things out. And I, I dig that. I understand. I don't have any problem with that specifically, but yeah, I mean, let us let us have some of that stuff. We'd like it. drink. Bear with me. Welcome in the person that slid in recently. I didn't didn't notice you pop in.
Okay, get that bottom one. Mess it up by just a touch, but I am not going to mess to change it again. This is going to work out very well. Because even like this one that has five boxes, it'll now have six. This one has five, it'll have six. There's one over here that has six. I just don't remember which one it is. I mean, besides that whole giant mess. Yeah, it's going to make a big difference. And I think it looks pleasant, too. I think maybe I'll uh, bring this back a little bit. Hmm, let's change that. Mm, okay. Grass says nope. There we go. And I even have enough space that I can do these along here like it used to be. I had to remove a bunch of them. Like every other one, maybe. Nice. This is going to look really good. I'm, I'm pleased with it. Okay. Right, the doors are 90 degrees, but now I have a little more space so I can offset them to look a little better. Do I have an empty? I do. All right, let me reset the day. So, I'm sure there are. There used to be for sure, 100%. But I think our three are the only public resource worlds that are still being updated regularly. Like, we're on it every time a new update comes out. I mean, we're out there busting ass to get everything in as fast as possible. Because, obviously, you guys want the new stuff. And so we're trying to get that stuff in there. And I think I want to change where this is to that because of the way it's doing the little uh, roof bit right there. It looks a little weird. That looks better. It's a little weird having a little roof sticking over onto those pieces. But yeah, uh, we're the only three that are currently and um nearly always active. I don't even know why I went out that far. There you go. Okay, so we got a couple doors. So we got empties there. I'll stack the doors. Let's do the big boy door on the back. Because he is a big door. And then this door, we'll go ahead and have the front, but we'll offset him a little bit. Maybe like that. Yeah, I mean, I think that works good enough.
For right now, let's do that. I need this first. Actually, let's. It'll be easier to set the boxes without that in my way. I need more boxes. Turn it the right way. Alright. Oh, that's damn close. I like it. I like it. Okay. So, let's see. That has stuff. Okay, so we're going to put it in this. We're going to leave an empty column, and then we'll put them in there. Right? Empty. Yes. Here. I would like to see a lot more secret doors. In fact, I would like to see a secret door of every stone type I know well, maybe maybe not the light blocks, but hell, I I'd be happy with a secret door of every stone type, and I want both vertical and horizontal. I know I don't ask for too much, right? I heard you, Wolfie. Where you at? What you doing in my domain, buddy? Okay, what was I doing? Box. See how well I did this one. No, 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 wrong one. Here we go. Very, very nice. It is coming along well. Now let's put our blurb in there. There we go. Very fancy like. What do we got? Oh man, that's going to get all messed up my bags when I move it. That's not fun. That's never fun. Okay, so how am I going to do this? Just 
What oh, is that regular? Yeah, it's castle wall. All right, it looks like it's just a regular wall. Do I want it in that spot? I think that spot is just fine. So it's right there. Okay, it's not quite that big, but... Why is it doing that? I have snapping off. Why are you snap doing that? God's really being weird. I wonder if it's the hitbox of this thing. Or this tree. Okay, I'm, I'm tired of uh, playing games. Let's just do it like this. It's like it's possessed by something. I don't know what's going on. One over on both sides. Alright. Two higher. We are now the same. Nice. Plus two. Very good, very good. <laughs> Almost. <laughs> Almost very good. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> I feel like I should put him higher. Really make him stand out. I'd like to do different, because we don't need them to all be iron. So let's do problem was the size that's why that's why he did it like that and then this yeah it's not it's not gonna happen so let's do a bronze and let's do a regular because he looks just disturbing in his regular all right so we got a bronze let's see And then regular. Maybe he's kind of up here. Really being nasty. Yep, that'll work. So that shows all three different types. The bronze, the iron, and the standard, or whatever they call the basic. 
All right, so let's get this going. That's going to mess this whole thing up, damn it. Okay, gonna have to wait on that one. That's all right. Whoops. Oh yeah, now that I did it, I, when I messed up and forgot to do this part, I actually don't like it without that part taken off now. It's interesting. Good enough. Okay. Boy, I got that bottom one close. Very nice indeed. I'm not gonna lie, I, I think they are right. The the few that said that when I built the hollow hall, it shrunk this and it just it seemed too claustrophobic. Now that I've opened this up for this job, I, I think, yeah. I think I think it it I don't know it's hard to explain it just it just feels better I don't know if better is the right word for it specifically it just yeah feels more appropriate what did I do with all these heads ha <laughs> they're in my bag okay so let's see let's do let's do both on the top and we'll leave the bottom ones empty. See, I'll put these clear over here. Sounds good to me. Alright, you mess. Let's see. Let's see what I can do with the, this big giant mess. Alright, so this is the basic. Let's see, let's do them in order. Matron. Ish. Ish on those guys for order. Then you, then you. Roughly that's the order that they would uh, 
that you would get them. So then heads directly under their counterparts. Oop. A bombs. We got some dragons. That's that one. That's that one. Alright, there's that. Now we need a little jobby right here. And then we move on to that. I do think I'm going to go ahead and call it for today. We got a lot done. We're at uh, three hours. I will be doing this again tomorrow, probably, probably the next couple of days. I want to get all of this completely ready for update four so that you know, I just start shoving stuff in boxes instead of having to do all this after, a, like I did with uh, Melly's, or let's see, the shroud. I had to do this after it was already out. It was my fault. I, I, I should have should have expected to have more ready, but I didn't. But this time, I think we'll be good. I appreciate everybody for coming. Slayer, we'll get together at some point, and uh, I can check out your world. Have a good one, guys.